The research paper delves into the distinctive chemical composition of LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357, a very metal poor star identified by Lee et al. 2022, as a red giant with unusual abundance ratios. A standard abundance analysis was conducted for this object and the well known metal poor star HD 122563, which shares similar atmospheric parameters. The results reveal several distinct features. Nitrogen is significantly enhanced, and the total abundance of carbon and nitrogen is very high. Alpha elements are overabundant with respect to iron, as generally observed in very metal poor stars. Titanium, scandium, cobalt, and zinc are significantly deficient. Chromium and manganese are enhanced compared to most very metal poor stars. Strontium and barium are deficient, with a lower senior Ba ratio than expected for the R process. The overall abundance pattern from carbon to zinc can be well reproduced by a faint supernova model assuming spherical explosion, except for the excess of chromium and manganese, which requires enhancement of incomplete silicon burning or small contributions from a type E a supernova or a pair instability supernova. However, the question remains as to why the abundance pattern of this star is so unique among very metal poor stars. The extremely metal poor star LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 exhibits unusual abundance patterns, characterized by low abundances of odd elements and neutron capture elements. Similar to SDSSJ0018039, LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 displays normal alpha element abundances and a higher carbon abundance ratio. High resolution blue spectra of LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 were obtained using the Subaru Telescope High Dispersion Spectrograph, with a resolution of R equals 60,000 and signal to noise ratios of 120 and 200 at 4000 and 5000 A, respectively. The heliocentric radial velocity was measured from isolated spectral lines, revealing no significant variation, thereby ruling out any signature of binarity. The atmospheric parameters of LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 are comparable to those of the well-known metal poor star HD 122563, which served as a comparison star for abundance analysis. Equivalent widths were measured by fitting a Gaussian profile, using atomic line data from previous studies. Strong absorption lines were excluded from the analysis due to saturation of absorption. The abundance analysis revealed distinct features, including the X, Fe values calculated using the solar abundances of Asplund et al., 2009. The results are presented, including details on the spectral lines for individual elements. The abundance ratios of LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 are discussed in the context of supernova models, providing constraints on the properties of the progenitor. LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 in HD 122563, two highly evolved red giants, have been analyzed using 1D LTE standard analysis and spectrum synthesis techniques with model atmospheres from the Atlas NEWODF grid. The effective temperature, surface gravity, and metallicity of LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 are determined to be 4660K, log G equals 1.01, and Fe, H, equals 2.86, respectively, similar to those of HD122563. Carbon and nitrogen abundances were determined by spectrum synthesis for the CH and CN molecular bands, revealing a remarkably high nitrogen abundance in LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357, N, Fe, equals plus 1.4, and a comparatively high carbon abundance among highly evolved red giants at this metallicity, C, Fe, equals plus 0.3. The carbon to nitrogen ratio of the two objects agrees well, C, N, equals 1.1, suggesting that LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 is originally a carbon-enhanced object. Abundances of alpha and iron peak elements were determined by standard analysis of measured equivalent widths. 
While the absorption features of alpha elements and phi of the two objects are very similar, the phi lines in LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 are slightly weaker, resulting in lower phi age. The Na and Al abundances show good agreement between the two objects, although the Al abundance is relatively uncertain due to saturation effects. Notable differences in abundance patterns between LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 in HD 122563 include significantly lower T, SC, and V abundances in LAMOST J1645 plus 4357, while CR and MN abundances are higher. The CR abundance ratio is 0.4 dex higher in LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 than in HD 122563, although this may be underestimated due to NLTE effects. Overall, the abundance patterns of LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 in HD 122563 are similar, but with some notable differences particularly in the carbon and nitrogen abundances. The analysis of LAMOST J1645 plus 4357, a metal poor star, shows significant underabundances of heavier elements like company, Ni, and Zn compared to HD 122563. The senior abundance is notably low in LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 while the Ba abundance is underabundant in both stars. The study confirms the carbon excess and low abundances of SC and T found by Mardini et al., 2019, but the crossing abundance is determined to be higher than previously reported. The discrepancy in company abundance between this study and Mardini et al., 2019, is attributed to the choice of spectral lines used. Abundance ratios of six elements for LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 in HD 122563 are compared with those of very metal poor stars studied by Lee et al. 2022. Highlighting the uniqueness of LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 among these stars. The abundance pattern of LAMOST J1645 plus 4357, a highly evolved red giant among extremely metal poor stars, is characterized by a high carbon abundance ratio, C, Fe, tilde plus 1, indicating it is a carbon enhanced metal poor, SEMP, star, specifically a CEMPNO star due to the lack of excess barium. Notably, the star's low strontium abundance, SR, Fe equals 2.4 and low strontium tobarium ratio, SR, Ba, equals 1.0, distinguish it from other SEM stars. A comparison of the abundance patterns of LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 in HD 122563 to supernova yield models reveals distinct differences. For LAMOST J1645 plus 4357, a quasi-spherical supernova explosion of 25M circle dot operator with low explosion energy and a small amount of iron ejection can explain the observed abundance ratios. In contrast, the high abundance ratios of scandium, titanium, vanadium, and cobalt in HD 122563 require a high energy a spherical explosion. The chromium abundance in LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 is overabundant, suggesting a large contribution of incomplete silicon burning in the explosion. This could imply a mechanism that enhances incomplete silicon burning in the progenitor or, alternatively, a combination of a faint supernova and a type E a supernova, which provides chromium and manganese as well as iron. However, the latter explanation is problematic due to the longer timescale of type Ia supernovae. The abundance pattern of LAMOST J1645 plus 4357 is remarkably primitive and may be determined by almost a single event. Further studies with self-consistent supernova explosion simulations are necessary to investigate the possible connection between incomplete silicon burning and sphericity of the explosion.
the study on LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357, a very metal poor star, reveals a unique abundance pattern suggesting a contribution from a faint supernova with a quasi-spherical explosion. This uniqueness is demonstrated by the abundance ratios compared to those of other very metal poor stars. The research utilizes data from the Subaru Telescope and the Guoshoujing Telescope, LAMOST, supported by the JSPSCAS Joint Research Program and various grants. The findings are significant in understanding the star's metal. with that of HD 122563, depicted by lines, highlighting their spectral similarity. This investigation is pivotal in the study of stellar evolution and the characterization of these stars, providing valuable insights into their properties and evolutionary stages. Let me know if this meets your requirements or if you need further refinement. LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357, a star exhibits distinct abundance ratios, which are compared to those of very metal poor stars analyzed by Lee et al., 2022. Figure 3 visually represents these abundance ratios, with LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 denoted by a red-filled circle with error bars, and stars from Lee et al.'s sample divided into two temperature groups. TEF less than 5500K and TEF is greater than or equal to 5500K represented by filled and open circles, respectively. Notably, only stars with signal-to-noise ratios exceeding 50 were considered in Lee et al.'s sample for this analysis. This comparison is crucial for understanding the chemical composition of metal-poor stars and their implications for our understanding of the early universe. By examining elemental abundances in these stars, Researchers can gain insights into nucleosynthesis processes that occurred during the first few billion years after the Big Bang, as well as the role of supernovae and other astrophysical events in shaping the chemical evolution of galaxies. 
As a representative of the most metal poor stars, LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 serves as a benchmark against which the chemical properties of other metal poor stars can be compared. This enables a more comprehensive understanding of the diversity and uniformity of elemental abundances among these ancient celestial bodies, ultimately contributing to a better grasp of the universe's early history and galaxy formation. The abundance patterns of LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 in HD 122563 are compared in figures 4 and 5, highlighting distinct chemical composition profiles between the two stars. The error bars represent uncertainties in X, Fe, values, including atmospheric parameter uncertainties. Notably, LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 exhibits significant discrepancies in elements such as carbon, nitrogen, oxygen, and iron, key indicators of stellar nucleosynthesis processes. These differences suggest that LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 may have experienced a unique evolutionary path or formed in a distinct environment compared to HD122563. This research contributes to our understanding of the galaxy's diverse chemical enrichment history, as comparing abundance patterns of various stars provides insights into the processes shaping galactic chemical composition over time. The study leverages high-resolution spectroscopy, a well-established technique in astrophysics, to accurately measure elemental abundances and infer the star's evolutionary history and galactic evolution. While the study's reliance on spectroscopic data may be limited by factors such as stellar rotation, binarity, and interstellar extinction, careful target star selection and robust statistical methods mitigate these biases. Future work could expand the sample size, utilize advanced spectrographic instruments for higher precision measurements, and integrate these findings with other astrophysical datasets to gain a more comprehensive understanding of galactic evolution. The paper by Aoki et al. analyzes elemental abundance ratios for two stars, LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 in HD 122563, comparing them with models for different supernovae types. It discusses ratios for elements like B, N, F, Na, Al, P, Cl, K, Sc, V, Mn, Company. CU, GA, C, O, NE, MG, C, S, A, R, C, A, T, crossing, FE, NE, and ZN. The authors consider models for faint SNE, type E as SNE, and pair instability SNE. The comparison is detailed in Figure 6, showing elemental abundance ratios for each star under different SN models. This analysis aims to understand the chemical evolution of these stars through their elemental abundances in relation to various SN types. The star LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357 is examined through two tables of data. Table 1 presents radial velocity measurements from various telescopes and observation dates, spanning values from 90.4 km per second to 79.0 km per second. The most recent measurement, taken on August 30, 2015, at the Subaru Telescope, yields a value of 84.6 plus or minus 0.3 km per second. Table 2 provides spectral line data, including equivalent widths for different species such as sodium, Ni, and magnesium, Mgi, along with their respective wavelengths, excitation energies, and oscillator strengths. These data are sourced from various spectrographic observations, offering a comprehensive view of the star's spectral properties. The radial velocity measurements and spectral line data collectively provide valuable insights into the star's kinematic and chemical properties, enabling further analysis and modeling of LAMOSTJ1645 plus 4357's characteristics. The table presented in the research paper outlines the abundance results for various elements in the Sun, HD 122563, and J1645 plus 4357. The abundance of each element is given as logo, X, where O denotes the abundance by number relative to hydrogen. The abundance ratios, X, Fe, are also provided, which represent the logarithmic difference between the abundance of an element X and iron. 
Fe, in the star compared to the sun. Errors for these values, including random errors and those due to uncertainties in atmospheric parameters, are denoted as ERA and ERRB. The table reveals a range of elemental abundances across the three celestial bodies. For instance, carbon has a logo, C, value of 8.43 in the sun, 5.30 in HD 122563, and 5.90 in J1645 plus 4357, indicating a significant variation in carbon abundance. Similarly, iron shows a consistent logo, Fe I, value of 7.50 in the sun and 4.77 in both HD 122563 and J1645 plus 4357, suggesting a more stable iron abundance. The X, Fe, ratios provide insight into the relative enrichment of elements compared to iron. For example, nitrogen exhibits a high enrichment in J1645 plus 4357 with a, n, Fe, ratio of 0 0.70, while aluminum is under abundant in HD 122563 with a, al, Fe, ratio of 0 0.81. These variations may indicate differences in the nucleosynthetic history or other processes affecting the chemical composition of these stars. The paper also highlights the use of Ti and T2 lines to measure titanium abundance, which shows a notable difference between the two stars, with J1645 plus 4357 having a higher Ti and T2 abundance than HD 122563. This could be indicative of different star formation processes or the influence of external factors such as galactic chemical evolution. Overall, this table presents a comprehensive comparison of elemental abundances and enrichment ratios in the Sun, HD 122563, and J1645 plus 4357, providing valuable insights into the chemical evolution and nucleosynthesis processes at play in these celestial bodies.